taste and ask Bente. He spoke more about bitter taste. Whenever you hear bitter taste, you'll have to think that bitter taste is related with ether and air. So it is related with the Vada. So Vada related problem, if we intelligent use bitterness, we can get rid of many Vada related problem. And India is the biggest country in the world which has the maximum recipes with the bitter taste. Indians are very familiar with the bitter gourd, a kind of bitter beans. And uh, many of the so-called bitter leaves are very common in India. And in India you will find lots of spinaches. And if you go to the spinach side, the spinaches, most of them have astringent and bitter taste. The so-called curry leaf is a good example. And when you look the spinach, like we have a healing system, which we call Chiravaidyam or Kiravaidyam or a medicinal uh, uh, division with spinach, you will find in certain area. So average uh, any of your problem, the grandmas knows the recipes with the spinach. If you have a gas problem, they will make a resum, a kind of soup with the garlic. If you have some poison problem, they will make some dish with basically with the pepper. And pepper has spiciness, but one of the most important character of pepper is detoxifying or the capacity to expel poison. So in Tamil, you will find a saying that Pattu Mula Hirinal Pahayavan Vitilam Shapadala. If you have 10 dry pepper with you, eating that, even your enemy's house, they are giving poison to you, you can get out of the poison. So, the, in this way, if you understand the bitter taste along with the ether and ether, ether and air, connecting with the Vada, if you go, you will find the, 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 the healing recipes of bitterness is amazing and uh, like that uh, the sister taste is astrogen so we are going in between that in our morning talk <coughs> にがいぶりですね。で、葉っぱの中でも、カレーリーフをはじめとして、いろんな葉っぱがこの苦味を持っていて、え、チーラバイティアム。カレーリーフ。チーライスピナッチ、バイティアムインストリートメント。ストリ
in the normal way or we should not take so such people we are giving in, in siddhanta ayurveda we give a kind of porridge we call payam payam means a kind of porridge with more water and less rice so you are not supposed to eat too much the same time you need it some kind of water and little food that we get it out of that えっと、ペーヤン。ペーヤン。ペーヤン。ペーヤン。ペーヤン。ペーヤン。ペーヤン。ペーヤン。ペーヤン。ペーヤン。ペーヤン。ペーヤン。ペーヘン。ペーヘ
flesh out of that muscle out of that marrow out of that semen out of that ovum out of that so if you want to convert such things in a in a place where you want to make synthetically you need a huge building and out of an apple if you want to make certain amount of blood certain amount of flesh certain amount of muscle like things if you want to make in outside you need a big factory then only we realize that what a magical machine god has given to us how intelligently things are working but unfortunately we are poor uh, machine operators if you love the car uh, if the car makes some sound giri 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 you won't drive it you will stop it you will call the factory or the mechanic you will bring it to the mechanic and ask what it is but some people they don't care let it make some sound it is i am in an agency i have to go to office they drive it and on the way something will go and you may get an accident or you will be in an off road so if you love the car some people love car more than wife the wife say i have pain you don't look the car say something sound you take so oh, i am not going anywhere i have to look the car so there are some many men they love their bike and car too much than the wife that is also another fact but if you love the car as a good man who love the car you have to look tire pressure fuel gauge and some sound coming something not good you will noticing and at once you react but unfortunately your body is also machine you are not looking your body is saying many things you say shut up don't say anything i am busy the body say i have a difficulty in the shop shut up this is a good fit good food you are in a marriage place you need not to pay anything eat as much as you can the stomach say darling i am in a difficult stage don't give me you say shut up don't say anything so you are asking to shut up your body things and you are not want to hear anything from there so continuously you say shut up shut up bloody fool so the body understand this man is a fool if i try to speak with this man this man is so busy with the different thing he is running so it is better not to speak things to the body and when when you when the body goes with you and go because body is intelligent so the intelligent body understand you are a fool and body will slowly start to keep silence so we don't have a communication with the body you don't know what is your body the body is continuously saying that this i am like this i don't need, need this i de- i need this so when you are in fever the body intelligently say i don't need anything that is why the body is making bitter taste in you but you are saying that no no if i don't eat the world will the sky will fall down this is what average people think and without the agreement or without the permission of your mouth your body you will forcefully push the food to the mouth and it goes to the system and it will again make the system more worse <coughs> にその林檎からあ、私たちの体ができてるわけで、そのさんもらったのもまあ、肉もしごもほねもあの精子もオイルスもできてるんだけれども、そのリンゴからほ機械で1個、そう、1個のリンゴからそれを作ろうと思って機
なんかそういうふうに体の声を聞かないと体もコミュニケーションするのやめるしその上で黙,る黙らせようと思って食べ物をどんどんどんどん詰めていくとますます寝起きになるだけです。One of the another name for Vata according to the science of yoga or according to the way of Siddha is Vayu. So if you call Vata as Vayu or Vata, it is actually the same thing. And the Tamil signs say anybody who comes to know about Vayu, we call Vayu e Arindavan, Kadavule Arindavan, that's what we will say that somebody who knows about Vayu, they will come to know about the God. Because It is not a visible thing, it is a, a non touchable, tangible thing. So, once you come to know the Vata properties and、uh, once you come to know more qualities of Vayu, in a way, if, I, if you want to understand something very subtle, your receptivity, your observing, observation, different things h a s to be subtle. So, in a way, Ayurveda w a n t to increase your awareness. Ayurveda w a n t to connect you with your body. We all are disconnected from the body very far. Ayurveda w a n t to bring you again back to the lost connection to reconnect. And when you reconnect with the body, your body will tell many, many things. And once you start to understand the communication from the body, If you, if you don't need to rush to some diagnostic center, the body will tell, I have this problem, I have that problem,、uh, for this problem I need bitter taste, for this problem I need sour taste, for this problem I need salt, for this problem I need sugar, for this problem I need bitter taste. So, in many ways, the body will say to you, I have a problem, this will be good. If you,、uh, if you don't send your children to school, If you allow the children to grow in a natural way, and if you send the children to a place where different kinds of food is kept, all the mothers are thinking children no, don't know what to eat. So the mothers think they have to think, they have to make things. They think because the children are fools, they are very intelligent, they are grown up children, are children, they don't have intelligence. And the mothers will make the food and push to the children. But if you send a children who have grown up in a natural way to a food serving place, a child, you know, I have a cup. The child is never going to touch the so, the so called sweet. The child is not going to touch the sour. The child naturally knows that what is good for me. Or if you bring a, a cow to a place, chicken, mutton, fish fry, o m e l e t and different kinds of things, and grass is there. The cow k n o w that this is none of my food. The cow will go and you eat the tender grass. Like that, if you take a children who is polluted by the mother's so called great advice, who is not polluted by your so called teachers and universities teaching, who is brought up in a natural way, who is not disconnected with the body, who still have a good contact and the, the, the good communication with the body. Such child, if you there are a lot of experiments are done in different places all over the body, and they, all the researchers were surprised. One and a half year child who choose some small onion when they have a cough, they take some spicy thing when they have cough, they take some bitter things when they have some kind of liver problem. But we think. Our children h a s poor intelligence, they don't know what to do, how to do, and we decide that it is our intelligence, our responsibility. We, we will, and we do many foolish things, and our children will get bad food, and as a reason, they will have poor health also. <coughs> タミルにはこういう言い方があってバーターを知れば神を知ることができるっていうような言い方があってあの見えない触れないものなので、まあ、そういうことが理解できれば神にも,も昨日も似たようなものですとで、えっと、私たちの体というのはもうすでにいろんな形でコミュニケーションを取っていて
要なものを分かっているところがあります。なので体調によってどんな味が必要なのか私たちが知性によって理解する必要がありますで子供というのは実は